If you ever played Metro and thought, you know, I'm not really receiving enough psychological damage from this, then boy do I have a game for you. Man, this is how I die. All right. Someone, and I do mean one person, has made a Metro VR game. Full-blown, cobweb-burning, mask-filter-changing Metro VR. And it hurt me. <gasps> I know what I'm supposed to do. I know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> Holy sh I, like everyone, love the Metro games. Those games were the grittiest apocalypse games I've ever played, with a great story and great survival gameplay. Real works of art those games were. Here it is, the swamp. Wow! <laughs> and they nailed it. This game is a Metro game. It may not be canon, but I really do feel like I'm back in the Metro. In some ways, it's even more lore accurate because all of the dialogue is in Kami speak. <laughs> Huh? Which is a great way to set the mood. The mood being terrifying. Can I pick this up? Oh, no, please turn that back on. I'm okay with admitting this, especially since the very last video I posted was me playing Outlast and not being scared at all. This is not an overreaction from me. This game wields a sledgehammer of spookiness very well. Are they really expecting me to just drop down onto whatever snarling in there? Are you kidding me? Because it's a story game. It's not like Into the Radius where the scares are environmental. This game can, and does, funnel you into these dark, disgusting situations just to toy with you the entire time. Oh, oh. Come on, that's so, that's so cheap. That sound effect, that was so cheap. The fear is unavoidable when they script for bass boosted kick drum number four to play when a rat scurries across the only path in front of you. Knife the lock. And even when you're in more open environments, the open environment is a metro tunnel. And that tubular claustrophobia is suffocating in VR. Oh, this is this is spooky. The tube is spookier than the the rooms. Cause it's so long, I feel like there's stuff in the distance that I just can't see. Oh no 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 no. It's no longer just on your screen in front of you, it's all around you. And when your character is already supposed to be wearing a mask or a headlamp, there is zero immersion lost. Oh, is that how much time I have left to breathe? Oh, that's not good. There's nothing to remind you that the four foot long spider scorpions you can hear crawling around you aren't actually in the next room from you. All right. But it's worth suffering through just because of how high quality it is, visually. And tech yeah. Whoa, whoa. Holy cow, this looks so good. It's so crisp. Oh, baby, what is this? Hello. Whoa. Pause. Hello. Skip to this time code. I have to now participate in the somehow time honored tradition of yelling at the atomic mirror brains. Please skip to the time code. You're missing out on nothing. I pinky promise. Someday, when this is all over, we can look back on this and laugh. But until then, it's a hobbit. It's fast ninja. <laughs> Is this like a thing? If I look this up, will I find this? How did you come up with this? Seconds of a gas Painfully bloated. Still a Cory fan, please buy him a sandwich from me. Corey, I think I owe you a sandwich, but I'm not really sure. This is too much. I don't, I don't know. I literally do not. Stop it. Get some help. Do my guy just, do my guy just fart? They nailed the graphics and it runs fantastic. Not sure how that's a thing. That looks really good. But the backpack is 100% ripped from Saints and Sinners. So there's that. There's no way you can convince me otherwise. Can I light that? I can shoot, shoot. Go. 
That is just so not okay to do in VR. That, that squirming with all those legs. That is not cool. And I'm glad I waited because the game used to be incredibly short, according to Corey. Hope this interaction doesn't lead to any kind of fallout between us. Fallout New Vegas. Roll credits. I don't know how much longer it is now, but I've already passed where he said it ended. Oh my god, you really have to crouch super low. Like, I can't just squat. I have to squat and crack my back in three places to fit into these things. Oh my god! Oh my god! I think I just had a heart attack. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. I hate how they make everything so loud. Anton's full story will continue. What? Hello, me from the future here. It is super short. It's like an hour long short. Which I guess makes sense, it is really high quality. If they waited for the game to be done, it would be the hottest game of 2027. But I'm really disappointed. I did notice on the main menu that there is also a new raid mode. Whoa. Okay, I'm sorry, what's going on now? It was in an update called the Cheeky Breaky update, because of course it was. Whoa. Okay, this looks cool. I know, chicken breaking. But I haven't played the raid mode yet. I'm saving it for stream today, just in case it's multiplayer. I'm assuming it's not multiplayer. It must be a PVE type raid, but I'll find out on Saturday at two o'clock. Does it say Makarov on it? Oh, I love that. Man, I miss when games could actually have the actual name brand guns in them. I'm tired of Call of Duty shenanigans. It's still setting in. I'm really sad I just beat this game. Metro is a perfect franchise for a VR game, and I was settling in for the long haul because this game looks so good. Do I gotta put it on the thing here? <gasps> oh, <gasps> it's a laser. But oh well, I mean, I guess that's it. That's all I did this week, other than make sure my parents' dogs didn't die, but that's not content. <sighs> I'm trying to edit. I hope whoever you are out there hearing my voice right now, that something good happens to you today. It probably won't, but law of large numbers, it's gonna hit for somebody, hopefully. Do I want to octopa this door or do I want to three this door? But if you give me the privilege of your time again and consume more of these pointless videos, then I will see you in the river. That's a Metro reference in case you didn't, whatever. Goodbye. What would have become of him? He would sell my stuff.